Super dog. Emma was doing her normal walk for her masters when she heard something in the distance. Help! Help! Somebody's imprisoned me in this horrible dungeon. She knew that voice. It was Princess Hayward who she had to protect. A few months ago, she had been given special powers by George the Cat. She was only supposed to use her powers for good for protecting Princess Hayward. She went into the bushes because she knew this was a job for Superdog. I'm never going to be able to get out of here. I haven't had any McDonald's in at least three days. Ha ha ha, you'll never be able to get out of here, Princess Hayward. I'm going to keep you forever, and nobody can stop me. Ha 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 ha. Superdog didn't know how to find Princess Hayward. She put her nose to the ground and started sniffing. She found she had super sniffing and could pick up Princess Hayward's scent. <laughs> Superdog zoomed through France, spared through whichever country Lillian and Towers located, and went through China really, really quickly. Then she realised she was going the wrong way. Oh no, it's Superdog. You cannot defeat me. Get her. They didn't realise that she had fur-like steel, so nothing could hurt her. <coughs> Fools. Now I'm going to get you with my mighty glove. Superdog used her x-ray vision to burn through the glove. Ow, ow, ow. I'll get you next time, Superdog. There was a bright flash and the evil villain had disappeared. Superdog decided it was time to find her Princess Hayward. saved me Superdog. Thank you so much. Superdog released Princess Hayward from her cell. Before she left, Princess Hayward said, I can really do with a McDonald's. Just can't find the cloak and change That sounds more 